Hey guys, welcome back to Montana Haven. I have with me today Dolores Miller, and she's she's my husband's niece. And so uh, we decided to get together and make some breakfast together. <laughs> and by the way, Dolores has her own YouTube channel that you need to go check out. She does. Uh, she's very good with with her voice and with uh, music. And so she does a lot of songs, and I believe you're gonna do some other things too eventually, just mix in, and mm -hmm. so, uh, where can they find you? So, um, you can just search on YouTube, Dolores Arlene. I have like all sorts of music covers on there, and I'm thinking about putting some motivational content on there as well. So yes, you need to check her out. And so, what we're gonna do today is, this morning, I. That I love eggs. I love eggs for breakfast and so I make them all different kinds of ways and this is just a simple way to do some eggs but the the best way that I like and um, I don't even have a name for it I just um, by the way these are our eggs from our very own eggs from our chickens first of all we um, we're gonna chop up some veg veggies and um, we have here, we have a bell pepper we're going to chop up. We have some organic kale and some mushrooms and sun-dried tomatoes, which are my favorite, absolute favorite. Yes, she brought those, <laughs> and I have not tried those, so that's going to be fun to try something new. And also, the uh, chop up a little bit of onion. We're going to saute that all, and then we're going to top it on the egg with... Um, and then also with this cheese. Now this is my absolute favorite cheese. This is the feta cheese that I just love, but people have to have a taste for it because yeah. some people won't like it. And also the I have some lacy Swiss that I will put on, but you can put on any kind of cheese you want. There's so many variations that you can try. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna get going and start chopping up. Mm -hmm. She just lives down the hill from us and so every once in a while we get together and just have a chat, go on a walk, or and, so, and now we're trying to do something together, just like this, making some food together. You know, I think it's pretty cool that um, generations, different generations can get together and just hang out and enjoy one another's company. Because yeah. aren't you like us 19? I mean 18. Yeah, you're not, you're 18. She's like 19 years younger than I am. <laughs> That's hard to believe though. <laughs> but it's so, it's so cool. I think it's so good. I think generations need to get together and, and learn from each other, mm -hmm. understand each other, right? Yeah. yeah. It's really important, like, for me to, to have, like, um, a mentor, or, like, I think it's important for any young person, whether, you know, you think you have, like, issues or problems or not it's just so good to have like a confidant and a safe place to just share and Priscilla has definitely been that for me and as well as a lot of other my other like family but I just think that's so so important so really glad we get to do stuff like this and just have fun while we're doing it too you know right right you get to know you know often the older generation forgets how the younger generation thinks and the younger generation will often think you know, uh, you know they're so old school. When it's really not like that, if we get to learn, if we get to know one another. Therapy session here. I just, just wanted <laughs> you to see her cry. <laughs> so sweet of you. I made her cut up the onions. <laughs> here we go. Dolores is putting onions in there. And next, we're gonna put the bell peppers in. <laughs> and just thought. Saute those for just a little bit. And you could probably put the mushrooms in too, by the way. Now, okay, yeah. Mmm, doesn't that look good? Hey, Dolores, I think you could put in the spinach. Okay. Or actually, it's the kale. <laughs> you can use all kinds of stuff. You, all kinds of whatever you like to put on top of your eggs. It just makes for a delicious and nutritious breakfast. Mm -hmm. Here I have some uh, dried tea from our garden. Just dried mint tea from our garden. And so I am heating up some water and just putting some of this
this dried tea in here and filling it up with hot water and let it sit for a while and we have some good delicious tea. Okay, the veggies are almost done sauteing, so I am going to start my eggs, and we're going to each have two, so we're going to have a big amount. I just put them in here in the pan, um, and just let them fry up, and in the meantime, we're going to put these sun-dried tomatoes in. Would you put all of it in, Dolores, or just um, it? As much as you think. I mean, probably not all of them. It's a pretty flavorful food. Yeah. So I'm gonna mix that in. And these saute probably for about what was it? Five minutes? Not very long. Yeah. So I'm just now gonna I'm gonna shut it off and just let it sit here while the eggs are getting ready. And as soon as these as soon as I turn these eggs over, I am gonna put on the cheese. Eggs get get done very fast. Just and I am going to slap a piece of uh, Lacey Swiss on there and then I will go and put on a lot of these veggies. We probably have more than we need here but I have a couple little kiddos that would love some too. And then I'll sprinkle on some of this. You can come up closer if you want. Just mm -hmm. look in the pan. Sprinkle on some of this feta cheese. Ah, oh, doesn't that look amazing? And sprinkle on some salt. Just a little bit of seasoning salt. And some black pepper. And then I just, uh, then I cover it for just a sec. Just let it sit there. Turn it off so that the eggs don't get too hard. And then we will show you how it tastes. So guys, we are all done, and we've made ourselves a delicious breakfast. And my two little kiddos came down because they smelled the good smell. And uh, so we're gonna try it out. And we wanna give you a close up look. It is so good. It has all <laughs> kinds of veggies and mushrooms, and the eggs are still soft in the middle. So we're gonna give it a try. So. Did you want a bite? I'll take a bite first. Mmm. It's amazing. I wish you could taste it. You just have to make it yourself. Mmm. Mm. Those sun-dried tomatoes are good. Thank you so much guys for watching. We really appreciate it. And remember to hit thumbs up and subscribe. It's free, you know. <laughs> and also remember to check out Dolores' channel. Yeah. Hey, we love you guys. See ya.